Good to be back in Canada. I was down in the States and uh, where I was outed as a Canadian. We have a Canadian accent, you know that, right? It's weird. When you're in the States, Americans assume you're American until you say something Canadian. Like, A is a big giveaway, isn't it? <laughs> Americans assume you're American until you drop an A-bomb on them. It's always something subtle. Like, we never realize we're saying it. Something like, geez, the water's really warm, eh? <laughs> I'm not a criminal, but I'm made to feel like a criminal every time I cross the border. You ever get nervous crossing the border? You know when you have to talk to that border guard? You ever rehearse what you're going to say to him? <laughs> Standing in line, hi, hi, Ooh, no. Ooh. <clears throat> hello, hello, uh. hello, hi, hey, hey, what's up, hey, hello, Canadian, I'm Canadian, hello, I'm Canadian, hello, I'm Canadian. Hello, I'm Canadian. Then I get up there, I'm hi, I'm Canadian. Because <laughs> they make you feel guilty, don't they? Those American border guards, they stare right at you with their icy cold eyes, looking right at you. Where are you from? Where were you born? What's your nationality? Where are you traveling to today? What's your final destination? What's the purpose of your visit? Start crying, I'm sorry, did I do something wrong? <laughs> Different story coming back into Canada, isn't it? You got any fruit? No? Okay. Got He's okay. I like his tan. It's good. Got back to Canada and was attacked by a Canada goose. Welcome home. That's our national bird. Known all around the world as the Canada goose. I think as Canadians, we've all seen a Canada goose up close. Powerful, majestic, beautiful. Not words you're going to think of looking at a Canada goose. Drunk. You're going to think drunk looking at a Canada goose. And the Canada goose look like it's been on a bender for a few days. Hasn't showered in a while. It's kind of angry, stumbling around. Ah! You don't know me. Only gives you one warning sign before it attacks, too. Its head will bend from here down to here. So if you see this, run! Get out of there! <laughs> what animal does that? That's weird, isn't it? And it attacks in that position. With head back, the wings back, that beautiful Canada goose call. And warm your heart as Canadians to hear. We have no respect for our national bird. I can prove it with word analogies, right? If you're an American, you got an eagle. You can soar like an eagle. You got an eagle eye, that means you got great vision. If you're a golfer, you get two under par, that's an eagle shot. Good for you, you're an amazing golfer. But we're Canadian. We got a goose, so you get hit in the head, you got a goose egg, right? You get freaked out, you got the goose bumps, the goose flesh. If you're lost, you're on a wild goose chase. If you get goosed in golf, somebody shoves their thumb up your ass. That's nice. <laughs> now our national bird bringing down 747s in New York City, making a land on the Hudson River. Yeah, that's our bird. Wow. How stupid is our Canada goose looking at a jumbo jet flying towards it going, yeah, I think I can take it. <laughs> So now we're hunting Canada geese. Yeah, you can hunt and eat our national bird. That's not right. That's our national bird. You can't do that in the States. They love their bird down there. That's a protected bird. Do not shoot an American eagle. Canada goose, oh, help yourself. We've got lots. <laughs> They're kind of gross. You don't even need a gun to hunt a Canada goose, do you? Just some old croutons and a shovel. It's good, isn't it? Yeah. Look over there. What's that over there? You see it? Tunk! 
They're tough. They'll take 15, 20 shovels. Thank you. <laughs> Buddy sent me a video. Oh, it's classic. It was a it was a campaign stop that John McCain had. He was running for president down in the States. And he had a campaign stop in Ohio and a big outdoor festival. And he brought Arnold Schwarzenegger to do some campaigning for him. Now, I'm a huge Arnold Schwarzenegger fan. Zed Lacker. That's my last name, right? It's an Austrian name. So I've, I've been rooting for Arnold all my life. You know, the bodybuilder Arnold and the Mr. Universe Arnold and action movie star Arnold and politician Arnold. Nobody likes this guy, you know. People of California have to understand this Sacramento and... Come on, punch a camel. So in this YouTube video, you get to see the old Arnold, right? Because he comes out on the stage in front of 40,000 people. He gets all fired up with the energy, right? They introduce him. Please welcome the governor of California, Arnold Schwarzenegger. And he comes out there. California, Ohio, Ohio. John McCain. John McCain. Brank, Branco Bump Bump. Listen, no, Brank, Branco. He could not pronounce Barack Obama. Branco Bump Bump. Listen, listen, no. The people of Ohio have to understand that Branco Bump Badank, Balank. John McCain. John McCain. Branco Badank. Listen, no, no. Brank, Branki Bidinki Badank. Branca, Branki Bidink, Branca, 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 Badanka Dunks, Badanka Dunks, listen. And then his eyeball shot out of his head. Did you see that video? The last part was total recall. If you're freaked out right now, it was a movie. Thank you. Few of you have seen it. <laughs> what makes me laugh is that people come up to me after the show and say, oh my God, I love your Schwarzenegger impression. I do a terrible Schwarzenegger impression, but I have mastered it. <laughs> That is 97% of an Arnold Schwarzenegger impression. <laughs> I wish you went all the time. You could spot him coming down the street. You'd be like, oh, look, here comes the governor.